have some good news. We now hit 28 consecutive months of exceeding the punctuality standards that are laid out in Metro's contract. In fact, for August, we hit almost 93% of trains running on time across the metropolitan network of Melbourne. Customer satisfaction is up. The customers are telling us they like what we're doing. Customer satisfaction with the way that the system is running is at an all-time high. We have an aspirational target of trying to get to 95% and some of the weekly figures that come through to my office indicate we're not far off hitting that on a number of occasions. This hasn't happened by accident. This has happened because a lot of very, very hard work has gone into stabilising the Metropolitan Rail Network and putting the money in where it was needed. In 2013-2014 we put in $376 million into the network to improve reliability and to improve punctuality. And the proof is in the pudding as it stands behind me. The tram network, customer satisfaction is at its highest. Punctuality continues to rise. On the V-Line service, uh, we're above their, uh, their monthly average for the year. I think it's a really good story. I think the success of Public Transport Victoria, a single statutory authority to run public transport, has been a great success. But it's unfinished business for me as the Minister for Public Transport. We know we've got more work to do. We look at our public transport system through the eyes of our customers. We try each and every occasion to do something to add some value across the network.